is we're going to move the spark plug, use a 7 8 deep well socket to pull it off. We've already loosened it. We're at Ohio. Don't forget to lose uh, you know, the washer there. Now, a spark plug has a ceramic coating on it, and the importance of the ceramic uh, is to keep, uh, keep the insulation, keep the electrodes going the direction they're supposed to go. So as soon as that ceramic is compromised, uh, it allows the uh, uh, electrodes to shoot off different directions and different things. So the ceramic is really critical as far as the glazing on it, to make sure the glazing is intact. So that's why we say never, ever sandblast a spark plug. Now this one's a little dirty. It's got a couple hours on it, but not too bad. So the best way to clean a spark plug is actually to use a piece of Brillo. Make sure there's no oil or anything on it. We use this one strictly for spark plugs. And just take and clean the ceramic off. Just go around it a few times. Tuck it down into where the base meets the ceramic as much as you can. And then also up at the tip. By doing that, you're able to take all the etching off of it from the fuel air burn and you're basically left with a brand new plug. So that is really the best way to clean a spark plug. Maybe use a little MEK or acetone on it to clean it off if you'd like, if you get grease on it. So, um, But you can tell the ceramic's cleaned up real nice. So to inspect the spark plug, you just want to go around it, make sure, again, that glazing is in good shape, and uh, make sure the electrode is nice and square in the tip of it. Sometimes they'll start melting away if the, if the gap is too close.